What's up, guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be here with you guys. We are on our Town Hall 8 for a Let's Clash episode, guys. We've got um, our barracks boosted. I just boosted them, so we're going to be doing some raids. Um, let's go ahead and go on the attack, and hopefully I can find something towards the beginning to use uh, this barch on. And this already doesn't look bad because it looks like the majority of that gold is on the outside. Guys, when you have your barracks boosted, it's, it's good to just attack bases that have an okay amount of loot because um, I think it only takes a couple minutes to get uh, your troops trained up. So if you're searching for too long, you're not really using your boost uh, as effectively as possible. So right now, we honestly probably won't even... Uh, deploy too much more so that this way we can keep our we can keep the majority of our troops so we're pretty much um, we're pretty much farming the uh, the mines and pumps at this point so we're about to get in here up at the top though and get a little bit more of that gold um, no don't go up. okay I guess you can go after the town hall <laughs> so they're gonna go after the town hall I do however want to get in here and try and take out some of this gold storage at least um, why are they not going in towards the gold storage I gotta get rid of that town hall before my archers will go in there. Come on. There we go. Alright, so now these archers are gonna come in there. Let's see if we can drop in a couple of barbarians and they're gonna go the wrong way. Sweet. Alright, so these archers are gonna head up in there and that mortar is going to take out hopefully the group closest to it. Yep. And then we are just gonna continue taking away at it. We're not getting that much loot from it right now. That mortar is now distracted at the bottom of the base and the archers are going to finish that off. So we can actually go ahead and end that battle right there. We saved a couple troops, got 90,000 gold, 26,000 elixir, and that um, that loot bonus. So we're just going to fill these up, and I guess we'll talk a little bit and uh, upgrade some stuff. So mainly what I'm upgrading right now is my walls, obviously, as you guys know, because practically everything is maxed out. Um, we'll go ahead and look around the base, though, and make sure that that is true. Um, I remember we maxed out this uh, elixir collector down here earlier. Um and all of our barracks are maxed out all of our army camps are six six yep and six so all of our all of our army camps are six all of our uh <clears throat> all of our cannons are maxed out we can't upgrade that dark elixir drill uh we can upgrade the storage but we don't really need to um and we don't have enough to do that so we're still working on that obviously teslas because teslas can be upgraded a whole whole bunch but right now, we've got one at five and two at four. But we need a lot more gold to get that up. So hopefully, we will be able to do that. We've got 136 troops already uh, running through this thing. But I guess we can go ahead. All of our air defenses are maxed out as well as our wizards. And our mortars are all level six also. So we've already got that fourth mortar up. Um, let's see here. We could upgrade bombs. Uh... We could upgrade bombs, but I think I want to upgrade walls. Uh, we've got one bomb upgraded to, I believe, level 3 right there. This one's level 2. This one's level 2. Uh, we could upgrade both of those, and it would only take a day. It's going to cause a lot more damage. Uh, do we want to do that? Do we want to upgrade bombs? Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. So we're going to upgrade that bomb, and we're going to upgrade this bomb right here. That's two builders down. We've still got our elixir, so we can upgrade walls with that. Uh, and we are looking at 175 troops. So you can see I've only been talking to you guys for a couple minutes and it's already almost full. So we're going to go ahead and make sure that these are full again so that hopefully if we get um, an attack quickly and it's a uh, collector and, and pump attack, then we'll be able to come back and maybe even get a third live attack in this for you guys. Um, but I am curious, guys, do you all like the live attack style or do you want me to just record the attacks and then talk over them later. Definitely comment down below and let me know about that because I know a bunch of other YouTubers do that, but I like to do it live because if I mess up, you guys get to see me mess up <laughs> because everybody messes up. So let's go ahead and see if we can find an attack. Um, you guys think about that and let me know uh, if you would like to see it switched up at all. Um, we'll search for a couple seconds, see if we can find anything uh, with hopefully 100,000 or more. And then if we can't, then I'll go ahead and cut away and search so uh yeah i'll go ahead and do that i'll cut away and i'll be back with you guys in just a couple of seconds all right so hold on tight all right guys so we're gonna try and attack this one um i'm gonna go ahead and take out this mortar up here at the top and we are going to deploy pretty we're gonna spread out as a distraction for the uh mortars down there at the bottom 
And then we're going to drop off pretty heavily up here towards the top with our barbarians and archers and hopefully get in here to all of this gold. We'll go, no, king, come on, king. There we go. All right, so the king and the archers are going to work their way into the base now. Uh, we'll drop off a bunch more barbarians, and they will go exactly where I don't want them to go. So we're going to get them in here, get everybody up in there. Come on, guys. And hopefully they will start working. Oh, oh no, giant bomb. No, that giant bomb. <laughs> that freaking giant bomb, though. Uh, I'm going to drop off this heal spell since I have it in here. Um, and there we go. We got rid of that one mortar, and we are going in taking out the rest of that gold and that elixir. Um, that heal spell is definitely helping out a lot, especially with that bomb right there. They were able to go and uh, get some health. All those archers just went through it. We are crushing it. We might even get to three-star this thing, especially since that wizard tower is down and out. Our king still has an okay amount of health. We definitely need to start upgrading him. Um, I'll go ahead and wait and just three-star this thing. <laughs> but we need to start upgrading our king, so I need to start farming for Dark Elixir a little bit more. Uh, we only need 300... Uh, 3,600 more to upgrade him again. Um, so that was another good raid right there. We used all of our troops though, but let's see how much uh, was trained while we were gone. So half of our troops trained while we were gone. So um, I'll go ahead and upgrade, I guess, a couple of walls. We'll figure out which ones we want to do. And then um, we'll cut away and then I'll come back with you guys once I have another army comp ready because it shouldn't be too long so we have this whole core let's see how many walls we've got um already we've got 29 of them that's not bad we've got 29 of them all done um the core is looking well let's go ahead and, and do some of these joints so we'll upgrade this one and we'll upgrade uh this joint right here as well because the joints is where people break through guys a lot of the times the troops will go to those uh t junctions you can see oh didn't mean to do that. You can see that this right here makes like a T. Um, a lot of times troops will go for that so they can get into both sections. Um, <clears throat> but we'll go ahead and I'll cut away and wait for these last 60 troops to train up. And then I'll be back with y'all once I find another base. All right, so hold tight. All right, guys, so we are back. I got my army camp all trained up, 110 barbarians and uh, <clears throat> 90 archers. That's a little heavy on the barbarians, but we're going to be fine. Um... This guy definitely looks like he has a whole bunch of his resources outside. I know that a bunch of you guys are probably like, well, I'm tired of Barch. And I'm like, uh, no, Barch is love, Barch is life, right, guys? So we're just going to keep on Barching. Um, it's super, super effective. Uh, and obviously it works really, really well, which is, I guess, the meaning of effective. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and see how much of this loot we can take out on this base. Um... We're doing pretty good. <clears throat> We've got 500 more thousand elixir. Uh, so that means we can go ahead and upgrade another wall. Isn't that so sad, guys? We get to upgrade one wall. <laughs> um, so we'll go ahead and see what's going on. We're not going to get anything else. We got that loot bonus um, of 8,000. That's nothing compared to higher levels. Um, and we'll go ahead and upgrade one more wall. Um, we'll take out this point right here. And we are good, guys. We are upgrading a couple bombs. We're working our way up with our walls and everything. Uh, we need to get our king up. It is going to cost, yeah, 20000 to upgrade him. Um, so, yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. I hope you all are enjoying this series as always. Uh, leave a like if you like the video. And as always, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? See you guys later. Peace. Hey, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you leave a like down below for me. Also, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe right here. And if you want to see some of my other more popular videos, check it out right here. Thanks for watching again. Peace.